Hey guys and welcome back to another video on my channel. Today I am finally back with some fashion content for you and I am doing another memory review. So I did one of these two years ago I think um, when I got like their newest sandal like 1940s 1950s sandal um, and since then I've worn these to death honestly they're like the most comfortable flat like a vintage reproduction shoe ever so Mette who is the shop owner kindly gifted to me another pair of their newest sandals now because they just brought out these um, really nice like velour kind of um, flat sandals in different colors and I picked out the black ones just because I really didn't have any flat chic and comfortable vintage inspired shoes and they're here i've now worn them around three times already just to give you like a more realistic review and yeah without further ado let's get right into the video so here is my memory box they always come in this really really pretty box and then here you can see there's a photo of the style then there's the name which is um, ella this model is called ella and then here is your size and color that's very helpful because then you can see like right away if the order is right or not she always gives you like some really pretty cards with it so here's one of them and then there's this one which always also comes with like a shoe care instruction on the back which i think is really helpful and then here are the beautiful shoes Ta -da! that's how they look like so as i told you i chose the black model they have some really really beautiful other colors that i might will be getting after this um because i'm already so happy with these i really was in need of another pair of sandals because i've really worn the other ones to death um like i think i need to get a new pair i wore them for two years in the summertime almost every day because they are so versatile to style with you know every vintage piece that i had trousers shorts skirts and dresses um but these i feel like are a bit more chic because they are in this velour um optic like uh the other ones were like very simple like not shiny but you know typical leather and these have this beautiful almost velvety feel to them which automatically in my opinion makes them a bit more fancier so that's the model as you can see it has some beautiful cutouts here and just a really low wedge which is perfect for everyday wear and then here it has like a typical buckle and you can like adjust the straps to fit you and also they have a tiny little peep toe which is so authentic to the 1940s and 50s like there were some um, vintage sandals that also showed a more toes but mostly um, the women only showed like one to two toes in the front i personally prefer um, this style better because i feel like it looks more elegant compared to showing all of your toes just my personal thing um, and then this is what the sole looks like oh i need to get the sticker off I'm so sorry for all of the dirt underneath, we will just like ignore this, <laughs> but I've already worn them a few times as I told you. Um, yeah, and then they always have this beautiful gold um, memory um, labeling inside. And then on the inside you can see it is real leather, very, very, very soft, which is very important for me because I really have some sensitive feet and I actually get blisters in all of my shoes like all of the time when i get a new pair of shoes i need to wear them a couple of weeks until i can actually wear them because i get blisters and sometimes i can even not wear them at all because i feel like the blisters are not going away that's very annoying that's why i cannot wear lots of repro shoes but these shoes really are so soft just perfect for my feet and something else that i really like about these um and also particularly getting them in black I can either wear them totally casual with some trousers or I can actually dress them up which I already did with like some fishnet tights and like a nice dress um, that's the good thing about the velour um, and both works perfectly so if you're in need of some flat vintage inspired shoes definitely check them out um, I will also show you pictures of the other colors there's so many gorgeous pastel colors and I will also put a photograph of me wearing the new 
memory model while meeting Dita Fortis, <laughs> which happened recently. If you want to know more about this, check out my Patreon. I did like a whole podcast um, episode about it, how I met Dita Fortis. Anyways, that's a different story, but I wore them when I met her and it was just a perfect choice. And I wore them with some um, fishnet tights, but like skin colored ones, but I also like to wear them with black fishnet tights. That's all that I have to say about these shoes. I can 100% recommend them to you. I'm like really honest with you guys. I would never recommend any shoes um, or things to you that I actually didn't really like. Um, so if you have very sensitive feet or if you're just looking for a nice pair of vintage summer shoes that you can wear on an everyday basis or maybe even also when you're on vacation because we really don't want to get any blisters while being on vacation, right? Um, definitely check them out and also check out her other shoes. She has a lot of amazing shoes, I think, starting in the Edwardian era and going up until the 1950s. And they're all super comfortable. I also have some other 1940s style pumps by her. I think two other models and they're also super comfortable. So definitely check them out. I will leave the link to their shop in my description. Thank you so much Meta for sending me another lovely pair of your shoes. I would cherish them forever and definitely wear them in the summertime a lot. Thank you so much for watching guys. If you want to see more of me definitely check out my description because I will have my Instagram and my Patreon linked below. I hope you have a lovely day, evening, wherever you are. Stay safe and I hope to see you very very soon. Bye! Just come over on the sunny side You'll be welcome on the sunny side Every gentleman and lady If you're living where it's shady Come over on the sunny side